Well, good morning. It is Wednesday, July 13th, about 8 o'clock in the morning. Today, we are supposed to be having a storm rolling in. So, this could be one of my rather longer videos put together through the day. But we do have some clouds out, which is nice. Good start, I would say. Pretty thick. I'm running over to get some coffee as I'm waking up right now, but wanted to get an early start on this video. Seen some clouds over the hotel I stayed at last night. Stayed in a different room, which was pretty nice actually. But the clouds are coming in, and uh, hopefully this is a good start to a build. So anyway, I'm off to go get my coffee. So do a little walking and looking at the horizon over there. So I just got my coffee. I'm getting back to the room here. But I wanted to show you a little bit different idea or give you a different idea of how these things are actually building up for this morning and hopefully by this afternoon we'll have some rain it really has we really haven't had a good monsoon uh, season like probably for about three or four years now so I figure we're due. So this is the reason why I'm trying to stay on this as much as I have been here lately. And some of the video that I have shot, I've just kind of scrapped because it didn't build into anything outside of a bunch of clouds. But uh, this one I'm going to stick with, even if it uh, doesn't break or anything. Just let you see how they form through the day and what the potential is for a storm to break in the desert. And yes, it does rain in the desert occasionally. And when it does, it floods, which causes a bunch of accidents and a bunch of stalled cars. That's one reason I always liked Arizona in the summer. Had incredible thunder and lightning shows at night. The rain, the flooding. See different uh, ideas of how to drive in a storm. So that's pretty neat. But anyway, I'm gonna take a break from this. Go finish what I was doing earlier and then get back on this here in a little while. But anyway, I hope you guys like this video. I really hope something breaks today. So, I'll be back. Alright, so it's around 9 o'clock this morning. Started this about an hour ago. Now I'm fixing to go off on the adventure of the day. Hunting this thing down. And watching it build if it decides to do so. So anyway, I hope you guys like the journey today, and I hope you like watching this video. Especially the end of it, if it turns out right. But anyway, we're going to be moseying on down the road. I'm actually going to go back into the Fremont area and actually check that out here soon. So, be doing my traveling for the day as I put this together. So we'll see you through the day, in and out. So. Alright, so it's about 10 o'clock right now. I'm actually over in the Arts District part of Las Vegas. And this is what the clouds look like over here. Pretty impressive to me. And it is getting hotter out here. Well, not hot, but warmer. Like humid warm. So we are going to go on to our next stop here. Alright, so we are at the 1 o'clock hour. Took a little bit of a break to let these things build up a little bit. And over to the south they are building up nice. So hopefully they will build some more soon. And we will be getting some rain out of this today. It would be really cool if we did. But we'll see. 
Anyway, we'll be back with another report after I get to the next stop. So it is now about 3.30. I am back on the strip and clouds are actually building down by the Excalibur where I normally would start. So we're going to take a little trip down there and go check out what it's like in the deep south of the strip. So we'll be back in a few minutes as soon as I get off this little ride of mine to get down there. Alright, so I did make it down to the Excalibur wall that I like to use as a prop and also to lean on and also to get a clear shot of clouds coming in. Anyway, you can see they're fairly thick here, but unfortunately it looks like they're kind of trying to break up way down at the south end over there. So, I don't know. Maybe tomorrow is our better day for the rain. It does look nice. It is getting a little bit cooler out here with the breeze too. Just making me think that it could possibly still form and start raining. You can see how those have already broken up. Which kind of sucks. Sorry, it's just my own opinion. I want the storm. Just trying to get some other shots or vantage points of clouds. There's some over there, but nothing real serious it looks like, so I don't know. This day might be a wash. It seems like down at the other end of the strip, the north end, that's where they're actually at. So I'm kind of wondering if that's where I should be. Unfortunately, my time is running out today to be doing video, so must make a decision here soon. See the flag I got the last time? It's barely moving, but when I was having lunch, the wind was blowing fairly well. It did cool things off a little bit, but yeah, unfortunately, it looks like it's just breaking up over here on us. Summer day. Airplane's taking off. Now yeah, why not get one airplane taking off if you can? He's gonna be pushing up into the clouds soon. Well let me go do some walking around here, see if I can find anything else that gets my attention. So, hopping on a tram to run to Mandalay Bay to see if we can get any good coverage. Oh, that's why you see this thing moving kind of weird. But trying to get these clouds. Out what the news said. But let's hope. Alright, let's see if I can get anything here in a minute. Alright, so I'm inside the uh, tram station. And that's about the only set of clouds that are really out here that are worth even calling clouds. So I think I'm going to call it a day on this and continue to put this together tomorrow and see what develops. Now, as you know, I will be back shooting more video if I see something later on in the afternoon. But it just doesn't look like it's going to happen today. So I think it's about time to call the day on this. Try again tomorrow.
but you never know. We'll see what happens. Well, here's some more clouds forming. Hopefully they actually do some good here. Just getting little clips of this stuff right now to put this together, but uh, where I was at down there, the strip is actually starting to come alive a little bit with clouds again, just as I leave. Go figure. All right, so I get to my final destination of the day, which is work. A little early, but I'm trying to get this video up. And it seems like the clouds are now following me instead of me following them, which is pretty good. So, anyway, don't think we're going to get any rain today, but it was worth a shot. It was starting out good this morning, but we're going to pick this thing back up tomorrow and see where we get. So, we'll see you then. All right, so this is day two add-on to the video. It is about 11 o'clock in the morning on Thursday. I checked the apps earlier and they said that around 5 o'clock we should be getting some serious rain but we could have scattered showers on and off through the day so I am going to be doing some traveling until about 5 36 o'clock and try to finish this video up you can actually see the clouds actually forming real well today there's about 80 percent cloud cover so this looks like today could be the day there are some dark clouds that are mixed with the high ones but really too few to do anything anything to break but uh, let's see how this day goes let's see if we get the storm that I'm trying to get so I'm gonna go to my next stop here and set back up so see you in a bit all right so it's about 11:45. it's getting a little muggier out here also, the clouds are forming so-so eh, out at the south end. Over to the east, they're a little bit better, but kind of thin, but it seems to be more cloud covered at least to me. But, walking this way, You can actually see them rising up a little bit, and those are looking pretty good. And over this side, back towards Spring Valley, you can really see them building up, so there is a good possibility that this is going to happen. Anyway, think about taking the tram down to Mandalay again, checking it out. The thing is, I don't know if I'm going to get a lot of good coverage. I'm actually thinking it's going to be back this way today. I don't know why. But I am pretty impressed with those clouds over there, but we'll see what happens. Trying to see if they're going to start lifting and moving or whatever, so... Anyway, let me get to my next shot here. Alright, so a little bit better shot of the direction of Spring Valley, which is still Las Vegas. Uh, you can see the clouds over here. And they're actually pretty thick. So, those are looking good for a good build. Also, with the breeze that keeps passing us by every once in a while here it seems like it's getting a little bit cooler uh, temperatures reported about 103 right now so it's hot but it's also muggy which is making it feel more uncomfortable but anyway um, still chasing this thing down hopefully we're gonna get something it's really starting to look like we could all right, so it's about 12.30, still at uh, Excalibur. Kind of just trying to check things out here a little bit. The breeze is picking up and it is getting a little bit cooler, so that's a plus. 
but we kind of need the afternoon heat for this thing to kick up so I'm not sure what the lesser of the two evils are here suffering in the heat or staying a little bit cooler while this thing's building Well, I think I'm going to go to another spot, try to check things out. This isn't building as fast as I wanted it to, so see if I can find some thicker clouds somewhere. So, be back. Alright, so standing at the courtyard at the Flamingo for the last time. And apparently I just keep getting kicked out of these places for some reason, I have no idea why. All I did was go in and eat lunch. And on the way over to eat lunch, I was told I'm not supposed to be in here. That's kind of weird, considering the fact how much money I spend over here. And now I'm trying to figure out if it's raining or not. Anyway, I feel some sprinkles. Anyway, so, I am at the Flamingo. Clouds are forming good. And it does feel like it's sprinkling, so we're at the 1.30 quarter to 2 mark and let's see what's about to happen here. Just gonna move up the road, get away from this property and never coming back. So, wow, my monsoon video turned into a bad report on the Flamingo. That's unbelievable. Well, I would have to say that today is going to be a good day for the possibility of rain. Because these guys are getting a lot thicker and forming really, really nicely. So, let's hope we get it and let's hope I can get some video of it. That was the goal today. Actually, it was the goal yesterday, but it didn't quite pan out. So, let's see what happens. But I'm getting more hopeful the more these clouds are coming in, the more muggy it's feeling. And it is getting sticky out here, let me tell you. So, taking a shot at valleys and the backdrop of that. You can actually see these things are really coming in now. So, yeah, I'm pretty helpful for it now. Especially since I felt sprinkles coming out of Flamingo. Alright, so I'm going to go to the next stop here. Alright, so I moved to a different spot to actually get a good view of this. From an area to the strip view way over there it actually looks like it's raining but things are getting darker out here i'm just waiting for it to hit here in this area but way back over there it's definitely rain is falling i just don't know if it's hitting the ground yet but it is looking pretty dark around the Bellagio, so chances are getting good. So I will be back here in a little bit. That's what we got to the other side of that. But that's impressing me, it really is. Almost makes me want to go back down there. But no raincoat, no umbrella. Probably not a good idea. So I'll be back. So as I was walking to go get something to drink, uh, something caught my eye as I was looking right in that area. There was a lightning flash. Kind of waiting to see if we get another one or some thunder or something. This is definitely telling me something's about to happen today. But I don't know where. If I just would have waited two more minutes, I would have had the lightning on this. Oh well. We 
you can't get them all. The wind is picking up a little bit over here. And getting more cloudy. So yes, making for an interesting video now. This is what I was wishing for yesterday. Let me go get something to drink and I'll be back to this. Alright, you can see with these banners moving to the right of the camera here that the wind is picking up. Also, way beyond that little palm tree, it looks like something is falling over there. Right in that area. Try to zoom in. It looks like Berga. But it looks like it's actually trying to fall. So it would be something if it did. But anyway, they're saying now at any time this thing could break. So trying to hold off a little bit. And just keep getting clips of this. So I can try to put this thing together and cast a rain tonight. Or this afternoon. But uh, you see it is getting darker over here our area so that's a good sign for us it's definitely starting in the south and about 3 30 4 o'clock uh, the radar show that it's supposed to be hitting this area so we shall see I just know it would be really cool to end this with rain instead of a dry note especially as much time as I put into this in two days almost 15 hours so I'm trying to get it let's just see what happens So I'm not sure if things are kind of dying out or fizzling out. But I do know there are still some dark clouds here. And we've got this guy literally right on top of us. If you listen in the background, that is definitely thunder. had some lightning strikes over the strip about I think three of them that I counted nothing real major nothing real serious but it definitely had a little bit of a light show they're also saying that the winds could kick up to 60 mile an hour gusts and have almost an inch in diameter hail fall So this is going to make for an interesting afternoon. Almost reminds me of tornado season. Well, I'm putting the dedication into this, so I hope it doesn't let me down. It's around 5, 5.15, I think I'm going to call it quits. I really hope to get something out of it. Even if it is just blowing trash and nothing else. I'd love to get some coverage of this today. More rolling thunder. I do believe it'll be here soon.
hoping to get a close up shot of lightning, but I doubt that's gonna happen. Because my timing is way off on this. But still trying to hang on to the hope that it will pour. So, not really willing to give up yet. Decided to come to the back of the building a little bit, check out this set of clouds. Been having some pretty good thunder rolling through, so. Hopefully I can pick some up. This is definitely determination that we'll get some rain. There's some burger right there, which is rain that falls but doesn't quite hit the ground. So, ooh, I think I got that one. May have been lucky shot, having the camera in the right spot at the right time. Listen. Are we close? I myself would like to think what we are close to this. Problem is, is, there's no shelter back here. There it comes. Ooh, there was a big lightning there behind me. Alright, so we just got like a, a little bit of rain here. About three seconds worth. Pop. There was lightning over here behind me as I was walking towards this. So we should get another pop here in a minute. That was pretty good. see something falling on the ground. I'm standing behind the wall and it smells like it's been raining on the street. Now it's getting chilly or cooler real quick. The wind is picking up. It's getting cooler. Now crap is going to fly towards me. Gnarly dust in my face. The temperature literally just dropped about 15 degrees. This is not rain, this is hail. I am going to get under shelter real quick. 
you can see this stuff blowing in here. I think I'm gonna go under a little bit better shelter here. Now it's here. Big time. Oh, doggy. Yes, it rains in Las Vegas. Two days it took to get it. And this is a pouring, folks. Wow. Check out the trees. Literally, this just came out of nowhere. We don't get this too often. Over here, some palms just got blown off from the wind, so the wind did kick up real good. Let's see, three, four. Oh, am I glad I started rolling when I did. Hey, by the way, I don't think I've said it yet, but if you like the video, hit the like and subscribe. This one would do me a, give me a good feeling. And it's still lighting out here. Woo! Oh, this is going to flood a lot. Big time. I already see the drainage coming. Whoa. This has been going for about three minutes. This hard. This is impressive. Oh man, where I want to go, I can't go. Wow. Man, look at this. This is incredible. See how strong the winds are? Yeah, I'm not going out there. Need to try to do something here. There we go, set the arms up. I don't know how this is going to work, but I'm actually trying to shoot with two cameras.
Just like it looks, just when it looks like it's going to calm down, this stuff comes back stronger. Just miss lightning there. Another pop's coming. Yeah, I got two cameras going. Welcome monsoon season. Now if I would have stayed at the strip until 5 today, I would have been drenched and lost two cameras. Got another pop coming. Maybe not. I think I caught the lightning. I'm gonna try to mosey on over to where I wanted to go here. This is right down there real quick. Right around this corner. Try not to get soaked. It's a good spot to get it started. Crap. Ugh. I was in the back when it started. I went through that little alleyway. And it just came. I get to watch the people go out in the parking lot and get soaked. So I'm not even sure anymore how long this has been going on, but it's been going on a while. Oh, that was a good one. Well, two days of dedication paid off.
I knew it was coming in yesterday morning. I thought it was going to be here yesterday. Yeah, it fizzled out on me. It's okay though. Because today perseverance paid off. Well, all I can say is I hope you all stuck through the two days of video with me. And had fun on this journey. As I know I did. Especially right now. This was definitely the payoff. Well, it looks like it's going to drop to a sprinkle soon, so this video might be over and coming to an end, finally. But then the wind starts pushing more on to me and thinking there's going to be more rain. This is what we call monsoon season here in the desert. Another pop should be happening. Maybe. I think you're getting it all tonight, guys. The wind, the dust, the trash, the stuff falling off the trees, the rain, the lightning, the thunder. Probably my best weather video by far. Well, it's starting to feel sticky and muggy again. So, as much as I hate to end this, I'm having a feeling this is about to stop. Yet I don't really want to turn off the camera. Yeah, we're slowing down now. There's bubbles. Ah, bummer. Well, guys, I hope you stuck through this till the end and uh, enjoyed this because I sure did. This one was a lot of work, but the payoff made it a lot of fun. The clouds are still pretty dark though.
All right, guys. This is where I say my last two words of the video. And really hope you enjoyed this. Until next time, see ya.